Destination Net Zero What does the International Energy Agency 2050 Roadmap mean for the future of tourism? The landmark Paris Climate Agreement represents the commitment of the international community to avoid the most dangerous consequences of climate change by limiting global warming to well below over 2 degrees centigrade. To achieve this, global emissions must reach net zero by 2050. Although over 130 countries in the tourism sector have committed to net zero targets, research on the transition risk to a net zero economy is virtually absent in the tourism literature. The International Energy Agency has developed the most detailed global roadmap to net zero and provides important insights into largely unrecognized transition risks for tourism. Achieving net zero would require tourism to reinvent itself at both global and destination scales, requiring new cross-sector and internationally cooperative policy innovation and massive investment in infrastructure and technology deployment. The broad incoherence of tourism and climate policy represents an increasing vulnerability for future tourism development. A suite of indicators selected to represent key International Energy Agency recommendations was used to compare the transition risk for the tourism sector. The geography of transition risk will influence tourism patterns unevenly. The lowest transition risk was found in countries in Europe, North America, and China, while the highest risk was largely concentrated in small island developing states. The climate justice implications are inescapable. While the net zero transition will be disruptive for some tourism businesses and destinations, the impacts absolutely pale in comparison to those associated with high emission futures. The definitive call for urgent climate action in the tourism sector compels a new research, policy, and planning agenda to support a just net zero transition.